Hi everyone, thank you for joining me. My name's Sarah and this is my channel, Diamond Painting Dog Mom. So today I'm gonna try to do a monthly review. Um, it is now March 3rd and I had one finish and this is my new cat, Milo. So say hi, Milo. <laughs> um, and we'll see how far we get. Milo, Milo. Oh dear. So I just got Milo on February 17th, so the day after my birthday. And yeah. And we might have to <laughs> reconvene because he's just going to chill here. Milo, can you move? Milo, thank you, bud. I also got another kitty cat. His name's Dusty. I don't know if he'll make an appearance, but we will see. And that whining's my dog, Jack. He wants to be best friends. But anyways, oh, Milo. We'll see how far we get in this video. <laughs> oh, Milo. Nobody wants to see your booty. Okay. So, while Milo's here, this is my one finish of the month. And, yay, he's good. Okay. So, this is Muzzle Nuzzle from Diamond Dots. This one took me about 25 hours, um, but it took me a few months because I worked on this about an hour a day after work, and then on the weekends I was working on my work in progress, um, so my whip. So, looks again, this is from Diamond Dots. As you can see, it's very sparkly. Which, is, I believe Diamond Dots is really known for their sparkle. And I don't know if they're known for their cats coming with kits. So cats not included. <laughs> oh, he's my diamond paint partner now. But anyways, so... This kit is by Gary Fleming. Don't play with my... Uh, Milo. So this is why you put washi tape around the borders. I don't do it with these kits. Hey, don't play me. Um, just because the sticky doesn't really stick out too far. But anyways, I don't know if you guys would be interested in a um, post review on this kit. So let me know. Once again, dog whining is Jack. So this video is just going to be everyday life here at the at my house. Here in New York, we are getting actually pretty pretty warm weather for March and February. Tomorrow's actually going to be 60 degrees. Hi, Jack. I know. Your friend's on the table. I know. He's taking the spotlight. How awful. But anyways, guys, I really love how this turned out. Sorry for wiggling you there. Jack hit the camera. <laughs> um, so this one was a... 42 by 47 inch for the design size the symbols were really clear um, my only thing is is the 310 in this kit was awful there was a lot of trash a lot of trash but I had more than enough to finish once again if I do a post review I'll bring out the drills and kind of show you but anyway so that's my my one finish of the month sorry Milo I'm gonna steal this and then behind Milo is my work in progress i have it all rolled up because well it's a biggie so this is canine christmas by randall spangler and it's one of his ones that do not have his cute little draglings and it's huge so i roll mine up with a pool noodle <laughs> i get these at um the dollar tree for a dollar 25 and then I just cut them in half, and they work fantastic. Milo, hold that for me. So, but this is from Diamond Art Club. And I don't know how much I can get of this picture in there. Don't buy my canvas. Milo! Milo! <laughs> oh, dear. But as you can see, I'm almost done with it. My goal is to be done with it. <laughs> Milo! My goal is to be done with this uh, canvas by the end of March. We will see. And Milo may or may not help me. I don't know yet. Milo, I'm covering you. So as you can see, I'm working on this row. 
and um, yeah this one is a 70 centimeter by 95 and it has 48 colors and two two ABs it's a beautiful blue and white my <laughs> so I do have a washi tape border around this one and a cat in my canvas so he's gonna steal the show guys I'm I'm sorry I'm not gonna edit this I'm not gonna start over this is what we're gonna go with um, I plan on doing an unboxing for paint gems so that will also be very interesting um, and because of this um, I have hair in my canvases <laughs> And I don't know what to do. Milo, is it okay if I move you? Sorry, but bud. Ah. <laughs> Milo, my boy. I, I'm going to go put Milo in his cat tree. I'll be right back. Yes, I will. And my cat birds. There you go. Jack, bodyguard. Okay, guys. So... He's coming back. That didn't last very long. I will insert a picture of this, but we'll just kind of do a little tour of it. So, he's back. Do you see? Do you see that little paw? He's back. So, no, don't eat it. <laughs> and this is why Diamond Club has their uh oh insurance. So, Oh, he's wiggling. We're wiggling. All right, this will be a really quick video, guys. <laughs> but I just wanted to show you this canvas. And uh, just laugh. Okay, so like I said, 48 colors, two ABs. Um, I have put about 83 hours worth of work. I keep track of this on Gems Flow. What are you doing? Don't eat it. Don't eat it. These are bad for you. Don't poop them out. Sorry, guys. <laughs> um, so this is my whip going into the month. I do have one more, but I won't show it because it is a mystery kit from Diamond Eye Club. So I don't want to spoil it for anyone. But that one is an older kit. It's um, Nature Ocean. And I will say it is turning out beautifully. That one has 67, 68 colors. Um, but like I said, I don't want to show it. I don't want to spoil it. It is an older mystery kit from them. Um, I think it's number seven. I could be completely wrong. So don't, don't hold me to it. <laughs> um, so I won't show it, but that one is over halfway done. And I will get to that one after this one, but I'll be right back. I'm going to roll this up and I'm going to bring my next, um, Another one that I hope to do in March. Will it happen? I don't know. It really depends on what Milo thinks. Right, Milo? Because he's my helper. All right, guys. I'll be right back. Okay, guys. I'm back. It was just a brief blink of an eye for you, but from yours, just a couple minutes. I was avoiding dogs, avoiding cats, and just going with that. So this piece... It's Peacock's Lagoon by Dreamer Design by Ciro Machete. If I said that wrong, I apologize, but I did my best. So guys, Peacock's Lagoon, it's a 60 by 90, and that's pretty, pretty standard for Dreamer Design. I found those sweet spots usually around 60 by 80, and Milo's going to eat my canvas. Okay, but... In case you guys didn't know, which you might not, I love peacocks, and I love the style of this. Um, once again, I will put a picture in um, <sighs> um, I'll put a picture in of this canvas, so that way you can <laughs> oh, see this bad boy in its entirety. But this is what I'm hoping to start on. Most likely not finish. Uh, but start on in March. Like I said, it depends on when I finish my Canine Christmas by Randall Spangler. And um, how I finish... Sorry, Jack just took a tissue off the table and he's eating it. I will have to rescue that poor tissue. Um, 
like I said, completely, I'm not editing any of this out. So you can laugh with me. You can relate to me if you have pets and have to struggle with them. Um, guests being a, uh, a guest on your show or on your channel. This is just what it is. <laughs> um, but, so that's it. I'm fin hopefully finishing Canine Christmas. Finishing mis my mystery kit by Diamond Eye Club. And then working on this bad boy that's trying to fling off the table by my cat, Milo. Who's funny enough, his name was Cheese when I adopted him. So, anyways, guys. This is one I hope to do. Once again, I love peacocks. I'm not planning any to do any events this month. I have been touring around with doing an event on my own, but I want to research and make sure nobody else is doing an event similar to it. I don't want to step on toes, um, but my canvas is alive, but we'll see. Let me know what you guys think. If I did an event, I'd want it to be like wolf and fox in force themed because I, I love wolves. I love foxes, um, and I think that'd be really fun, but... Let me know what you guys think. Let me know what you guys think. Have you done any of these canvases? Um, which one's your favorite? And what are you guys working on? I'm also very curious um, as well. Is I had one person comment that they're from South Africa. And I'm curious, where are you all from? Are you from the States? Are you from, you know, out of, you know, a different country? I'm really curious. I'm from the United States and I live in... Uh, Western New York. Um, so yeah, let me know. Once again, thank you for joining me in my very interesting um, month in review. And Milo says thank you as well. I know I said Dime Pain Dog Mom is my, my channel, but I've since adopted two cats in the meantime. And I'll get into that when I do a weapon chat. But anyways, guys, thank you for joining me. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up. And if you want to see more from me, feel free to subscribe. Once again, everyone, thank you for joining me, and I hope you have a good, a good rest of your Sunday. Bye.